I have always had a passion for cars. Handling was always something I was missing. The fact that we are living on the countryside, we have very bad, rough road conditions and with a you know, non-proper working suspension, your tuned up car is simply no fun to drive. My name is Klaus Wolfhardt, owner and founder of KW Automotive. At the age of 21 years, uh, I decided to open a small little retail store in my you know, hometown Mohat. With the products available at the time on the market, it was simply not possible to fulfill customer demands. When we started with suspension in 95, it was me and some friends who fabricated the first solutions. 20 years later, KW is a state-of-the-art you know, facility, a you know, well-structured, organized company. We are in total almost 350 employees worldwide. Our largest operation is the headquarter here in Fichtenberg, Germany. And we're about 220 people designing, manufacturing, you know, marketing, software design, you know, we do basically everything here in-house. Uh, that has been key from day one and we do not expect to provide anything else than the best possible solution. Obviously, suspension is always a compromise. There are different varieties, different categories of products we're offering depending on whatever our customers are in for. Over those 20 years we in the business, the R&D process quite changed. You know, where it was simple at the beginning, factory cars of today are, you know, quite sophisticated. Yeah? They're, you know, well performing and to improve that requires just more efforts in R&D. That starts with 3D CAD drawings, animation, simulations on the computer systems already. Of course, bringing in cars, taking all dimensions, measurements, to find a small little bit you know, of improvement uh, on the length of the housing, the design of the springs, the shape, yeah, and the density of bump stops. Uh, that all plays you know, into the result in the end. The V3 suspension is probably one of the you know, most known products it's a product which allows our customer to realize their wishes in regards of you know, right height, but also dampening setup on the car itself. And the independent adjustability of rebound and compression forces, you're able to do an individual setup for your car almost as good as you can do it on a race car. Uh, if you compare our bottom valve, yeah, it contains almost you know, 50 bits and pieces where a common valve with no adjustability is probably a total amount of 10 pieces. So you know, all those parts are mechanically manufactured, they have tolerances and to offset those given tolerances uh, there is you know, a lot of work, a lot of measurement, a lot of adjustment on parts and to achieve in the end an acceptable tolerance field. Just to give you an idea about the bottom valve, here is the entire unit and I have just taken apart to show you the needle, a small little tiny part we use to adjust the low speed compression on our V3 dampers. And it gives you an idea of how small those parts are and just that needle itself contains already 15 to 20 parts depending on how much gyms we need to use to offset tolerances. With that many parts and all those tolerances, it's quite important to have a lot of quality assurance you know, throughout the process. You can see in the factory that there are several steps where we measure preload on the springs and adjust it. So a lot of efforts being taken to assure the quality of the product and guarantee that in the end we have a perfect working product. Supplying the aftermarket uh, is a big challenge. You know, different than to an OE project, most of the products we sell are, you know, made to order. And so it's one customer, one product, not just producing, you know, large batches, large numbers. Uh, that all plays, you know, into the results in the end. 